What is going on guys, Judo Sloth here and welcome to today's Clash of Clans video. Town Hall 13 has been confirmed. Yes guys, we received some very exciting information yesterday and I'm going to share all of that with you in this video. When is Town Hall 13 coming? What exactly do you need to know? I will share with you all of the facts, everything that we know about this brand new massive update. So guys, leave a like if you are as hyped as I am. We received some special information from the Clash of Clans team. They have said previously that Town Hall 13, Town Hall 14, even Town Hall 15 will be coming. It's the natural progression of the game. It's inevitable. They will be coming. They also said that two and a half years, that is the amount of time we waited in between Town Hall 11 and Town Hall 12, that that is too long. What they have said they are aiming for is 18 months. So we've had Town Hall 12 for well over a year. We received some even better information from the Clash of Clans team that I will share with you throughout this Let's Play episode. The brand new levels. Every Town Hall level brings a new troop and a new defense, or it tends to. It brings something signature to that Town Hall. What do you guys want to see? Share with me your ideas in the comments. If there's any cool ones, I will be sure to pass them to the Clash of Clans team and like other people's comments that you think are awesome. But for me, a new troop, what I would love to see in the game is a troop that I could tell it where to go. So we have defense targeting troops. We have the Lava Hound, which targets the air defense, but I would love a troop that I could toggle in the troop information screen and tell it, hey, I want you to target the town hall, or I want you guys to target the nearest inferno tower, perhaps even an air sweeper. I think that would add such an element to the strategy, but I don't think it will ever be added to the game. Now the reason for that is it would add an incredible amount of complexity alongside that and adding more complexity is not always good for the game but let me know what troops you would like to see. In terms of defense, I think that bringing Town Hall 12 as a defense was very intuitive by the Clash of Clans team. I think that it made it something to protect the Town Hall, but I don't think they should go any further with buildings. I think the storages, they add a strategic element themselves. You can use them in base design to stall troops. Even the trash buildings, you have to integrate them into your attack. You have to think about taking them down in sufficient time. So I think the defense needs to be a signature defense. The mortars are very underwhelming. We've seen the lava launcher for Builder Hall 9. Perhaps we can see something like that. Or perhaps we can see something like a hero that works on offense and defense. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. But what is that information we received? Well, Darian, the community manager, did a q and I'll link it down below. I'll share you a little snippet here. Then we will do an attack. But a little teaser what the next update could be. He said it won't be a new town hall level. But he was asked specifically about Town Hall 13 and he gave a very in-depth answer. In terms of attacks here, you guys know that I've been using the Queen Charge into Hogs. If you're interested to see how this army works, I'll link a video at the end of this one where I break it down. This is Itsu's army, the number one player in the world. It's incredibly powerful. I will link it at the end so that you can see it in a bit more depth. I want this to be a little bit of a let's play, but mainly the Town Hall 13 information. Now a sneak peek guys, tomorrow I'm going to be sharing with you my base. It will have the base link the best base i've used in legend league so be sure to subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out it is the one star legend it just gets one stars all of the time it's awesome and i'm going to share that with you tomorrow so before we get into that town hall 13 information and that specific question let's do a quick attack let's hope we get the three stars but i don't know what type of base will we see right 
town hall across to the left. We could charge in to get the Queen and the Eagle from this area as a backup plan. Even if we don't get the Town Hall, we could potentially, you know, come in from this side with the Hog Riders, although the King is there. We would have charged from this opposite side. We could get uh, a, a, the Eagle, a Multi. Maybe charging from the top would be helpful as well, actually. I think the top is the better option, actually. I think the top is the best option, so that's what we're going to do. There's a hole in the base here. That might be helpful to put a pecker in. Ah, oh, it goes the wrong way. Okay, let's uh, let's actually use a hog rider here to help take that archer tower down. And hopefully we've created the funnel sufficiently. Come on, hog rider, get that archer tower down. We need it down. Boom. Nice funnel. Nice funnel there. Let's go ahead and use the king here uh, alongside a troop there. And let's use the wall wrecker here, followed by the queen, a balloon to test for any air mines. And then we can use the healers once the queen is taking some damage. I'm actually going to protect my wrecker here because it's taking a lot of damage. We missed the double cannon. Not ideal, but we're going to be in anyway. Got to make sure. Let's use the king's ability because I want the healers to get onto the queen. Balloon there. That should create a nice funnel, actually, for my queen. And still not needing to use the healers. Now let's use them. That should go to the queen. Let's go ahead and poison that. Don't go across to the king. That is not ideal. That's not what we need. We need the queen in there to get them. So the poison is not going to be helpful for a lot of these loons. I'm actually going to freeze them because that will save the ability from the queen. If we use the queen's ability, obviously we don't then have it for later on in the raid. Not too bad at this point. She's taken a lot of damage there. Had to use the ability there, in fact. I don't want the... Um, the troops getting onto the healers here. I'm actually going to start with my troops on this side to press through there. Looking good. I don't have to use that rage as of yet. Now I'm just saving onto it and I'm going to use it before the rage ends out on the last one. We're getting close to that percentage we need in order to then move towards the town hall with the hog riders. But I do want at least one troop for cleanup here. We're not going to have the town hall activated just yet. Coming to three minutes remaining. Come on, queen. Get through that area. Looking good. Ah, we're at 42%. I need to wait until the queen can activate the town hall, but we're going to run out of time if we don't go, guys. So we're going to have to go. Hope that the hog riders get to the town hall. Let's get that wizard in to help. We're at 45. We need that town hall activated. We need a heal here because there's so much potential for giant bombs. 49 should be good. 50. One more percentage. There it is. The town hall will activate. Let's use the Grand Warden's ability to get through this, through the Giga Bomb. Queen is going to go down. Only 27 seconds. But it was enough to rescue this raid, get the two stars, saving onto the heel at this point. I know, guys, we could have been way more efficient here to get this done. Waited and waited on the queen charge, but it was a pretty epic queen charge. We are just practicing with this army, and if you want to see some three stars from it, hell, we would have got this done had we have been able to get a better percentage with the troops yeah, Hog Riders would have got it. 69% it is, guys, but a decent attack practices the Queen Charge. What about that Town Hall 13 information? Let's tell you, and again, if you want to see some three stars using the Hogs, I will link the video at the end run out of time there, but I got to practice the Queen Charge. So, Town Hall 13. Darian gave us some incredible information, guys. He was asked in the Q&A, and again, I'll link this down below. Will Town Hall 13 be coming this year? His answer, it's inevitable that this question would pop up. We have two more updates planned for the rest of the year. While we don't generally announce major updates, I'd call Town Hall 13 a major update, until we're ready to announce it, we have updates planned for mid to late autumn and one more for the end of the year. Now, remember he said the next update would not be Town Hall 13. That's the one there that he's mentioning, mid to late autumn, but one more for the end of the year. Since we have the ESL finals for the Clash of Clans World Championship, we wouldn't add a new Town Hall level, throw the whole competition into disarray. Makes sense. So Town Hall 13 not coming before the October finals, clearly. Um, yep, yeah, goes through all that. Like we said at the start, it took us 2.5 years to introduce Town Hall 12 
after the release of 11, as we've been saying, we don't want the same gap in between 12 and 13. It's not giving anything away by saying that there will be Town Hall 13 at some point. So Town Hall 13 is confirmed. While this is not a hard commitment to timelines, we would like to release a new Town Hall level every 18 months. That is pretty epic. That's not a guarantee, but more when it would arrive, how frequently they want the content. So it's not a definite, yep, you'll see one every 18 months, but that's what they'd like to aim for. We have a pretty big update slated for the end of the year. Feel free to speculate or try to read between the lines, if you will, but it's going to be a massive update with some pretty cool features. Town Hall 12 came out in the summer of 2018. 18 months they're aiming for. They have a pretty big update at the end of the year. They've confirmed Town Hall 13. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I am super, super hyped for it. I can't wait to see what they come up with. The Giga Tesla, I think, was very intuitive, and I think they hit Town Hall 13, or Town Hall 12, on the mark. I think they got everything right, and I really hope to see some incredible stuff with Town Hall 13. Let me know what you want to see. Leave a like if you're hyped. And what do you speculate, giving the information we now have? If you want to see more videos, more attacks from the Hog Riders, including some three stars, click on the video I've linked here. You definitely don't want to miss it if you are a Legend League player, because that will help you out a lot. Turn on that notification bell, because tomorrow I will be sharing with you my base, but that is going to wrap it up for this one, guys. Until next time, peace out.